disposal. Um, so yeah, let's uh, leap, leap into this void. So, you've come to me again for more inside deets about the forthcoming second season of Squid Game, have you? Well, um, uh, as long as Netflix isn't around, I think I can, I think I can tell you this. Um, episode eight, episode eight, which is the penultimate episode of the season, um, halfway through, and it's not entirely clear why. In fact, oh, well, we'll get back to that maybe on another spoiler. It's not entirely clear, but um, for the second half of that episode, and it's like a, it's the longest episode that they've ever done. It's 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 two hundred and forty minutes long, episode eight of Squid Game. It's ludicrous. It's ludicrously long, and about two hours in, we're thinking this is going on a bit, isn't it? God, this is going on a bit. Two hours in, suddenly becomes a a, a fully choreographed musical. Yeah, yeah. Um, there's a brilliant uh, song. Um, I think it's uh, round about the half halfway of the musical segment. There's a fantastic song where they kind of. Um, a, a lot of people get wiped out, obviously, because it's towards the end of the series. Then you need they need to get rid of a lot of players. There's a fantastic song, which is sort of the percussion of the of the of the song is sort of the um, the, the 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 guns being fired. Uh, yeah, so it's kind of like people sing, and and you get like characters, a couple of major characters. Again, we're going to come back to that. A couple of major characters who actually get sort of shot mid mid line as well. And then, like another character has to run, run on and, and finish the line for them, because otherwise it'll break the song. It's so it's like, it's like they know they're in a musical. It's it's just properly weird, because because generally speaking in musicals, you kind of get the feeling that nobody really knows they're in a musical. It's just like they just occasionally they'll just launch into songs, and that's just that's just how they express themselves in this world. In fact, that's a really important question: Do musicals exist? in the world in which musicals happen. If, if Maria from West Side Story, if she uh, was to go to her local theatre, would she be able to go and see um, uh, The King and I? I've got no idea if that chronologi chronologically makes sense, but you get my point. Do they have, do they have musicals? Do they have musicals? Maybe, maybe they have the reverse of that, which is where they go to see the King and I, and uh, the weird thing about the King and I as a dramatic presentation in the musical world is that nobody sings at all for the entire thing. People coming back going, I, uh, I don't get it. They were they they were reaching like a, a really important emotional hello wrapped across. Uh, I am well. Um, the uh, yeah they um, they were get, reaching oh you know this emotional crescendo. And I was certain they were going to break into song, but they just kept talking. Surely they, surely they must realise how weird that is. Anyway, that's your spoiler uh, for this week uh, for season two of Squid Game. And uh, now back to the show. <laughs> 